When it comes to normal projects, it would be expected that there'd be a QC inspection program initiated. But what we've managed to do on this project is implement a risk-based assurance approach. We carry out criticality of all the equipment and plant and activities, and that's done on a safety and a, a safe operational basis. The aim of carrying out concrete assurance surveillance is, is to verify the work process on the ground to ensure that specified requirements are met to avoid rework or failure. It's to ensure activities that follow module installation, piping and electrical works are not compromised. I carry out uh, construction surveillances on all different areas of the construction of the tank just to ensure that all the procedures are followed all the specifications are met and all inspection is carried out. The successful implementation of this surveillance programme will ensure that we get things right first time, we don't have any impact to the overall project schedule and we implement value adding improvements for the project. We've identified a number of key areas where we focus our attention integrity, tightness, clean build, preservation and inspection and testing. Clean build starts with piping in storage. We need to make sure that it's preserved. Also throughout the installation process, ensuring that it's kept clean. Tightness really relates to the piping systems or the joints within the piping system, ensuring that a flange management procedure is being followed. We've got approximately 700 low voltage motors on site and 17 high voltage motors. There's a number of items that we look at and we follow through with the manufacturer's requirements and the project specifications. There's a couple of key points that we've got to look at from the installation of cables. Two main points is to ensure that the cables aren't overstressed. The other item with cables is the bending radius. Uh, obviously we don't want to make, make sure they don't bend too, too uh, tightly. Quality starts at the top. We're fortunate that the midstream senior management embraces this concept. And I have to say, in particular on this project, the contract has been very supportive of this process. This is what quality is all about. <laughs>